are now listening to the sounds of mood swing music group. Hey yo, welcome back to the channel. And what we gonna do today is get back into Scalar 2.4.1 with mixed with machine. Put them in the blender, see what we can come up with. So on the first video, we did some chords. On the second video, man, we came up with us a melody. And on this third video, man, we just gonna get into it and see where it takes us, man. So uh, let's get started. Let's start out by listening to what we came up with on the, on the first two. We start with just the chords. You know what, man? I'm 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 feeling this though. I'm feeling this. So let's uh let's mute these two. Let's go into this one. As you can see, I already dropped the chords in there, just to save us a little time. And on this one, man, I don't know what we gonna do. We got chords, which is the foundation. We got a melody, which is which carries the track along with the with the uh, beat and percussion. Let's uh, I don't want to get into bass line yet. Let's let's see if we can find some strings, man. Something that'll uh, be appealing to us, because then we might add us uh, some kind of harp on here too. Something, some kind of guitar, or something just to give it some flavor. But let's go to string ensemble. And let's see what string ensemble sound like with these chords we got so far. Man, that sound kind of dope. So let's tweak it just a little. Let's go... Let's just go into a performance and perform. Let's play it from there and see what it sound like. Man, that's sounding kind of dope. I think we just need to tweak that. Let's go to humanize, let it hit on both, yeah. Let's go to voicing. Let's make it dynamic. Yeah, we can go up an octave. What the heck? Uh, let's see what that sound like. Man, that's kind of dope. That's dope. We're going to keep it simple, too. Let's see what it sounds like with the rest of these joints, man. That's sounding kind of fly, though. That sounds like something we can work with. That's, that's 
Man, so we just came up with the strings for this joint, man, in like five minutes. All in all on on a uh, all on Scala, man. Scala just put us on. So you see how fast you're gonna be producing with Scala and with Scala with machine, man. This ain't just me doing this, man. This is a uh, this is the way it go down, man. I mean, I like Scala because when I'm trying to write music for an artist, Scala and Machine together help me write a lot faster. You know what I'm saying? So I can write music a whole lot faster than normal when I'm dealing with the two of them. So, and I'm talking about original music. It's so easy to write original music with both of them. But right now, man, since we did that so quick, let's add one more element to this baby, man, and see what we can come up with. Let's go ahead and go. What we going to do, man? Let's play. Yeah, so we had those chords. Let's do some bass, man. Let's go ahead and add some bass on this joint. I don't know which one. I don't know what they really sounding like. Man, and then let's go to perform. No, let's not go to performance. Let's go to... Yeah, let's go to performance and go to bass and see what it come up with. somewhere different, man. Let's open up a different EQ. Not the EQ I want it. No, I don't want that EQ. That EQ came out of, that's an Apple EQ. I don't want that one. Let's go. I don't even know what this Blue Cat is anymore. This is so old. This is so old, I have no idea what this EQ is, but we'll check it out. I might just use the EQ that's in... uh in machine ah uh, yeah i ain't seen this in a long time too but we check it out
much of my time. Don't want to waste as much time on this. So I cut these highs out. Raise up a little bit of the mid. So yeah, man, there we go, man. We added a little bass to it. We added some strings to it. And that's going to do it for this video, man. So if you if you like what you saw in this video, man, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Hit that like button. Uh, also, subscribe. When we get to that magic number I talked about in the earlier videos, man, I'm going to be giving away a PC equipment out of my studio. Uh, we might come back and revisit this because I feel like I, uh, I, like I want to come back do a couple more things to this track and then uh you know add a little more scaler to it add a little more machine to it add a little more of my flavor to it and see what it come out like man so until the next time man peace